Here one, Delta one here. Okay, so I had to. I was gonna shoot this with my other camera, but I had someone message me earlier today about whenever the parts came in to basically do an unboxing. Um, I have two packages that came today. Actually, I had three, um, but the other one wasn't as significant as these two. Um, essentially, as before. The bike is going to get a complete, um, um, I want to say it's an update, but it's not going to be an update. It's going to be really a, uh, a strip down to a naked. So the seat came in today. I have to clean it, but the black seat came in. The rear tail is going to get painted and clean. The frame is going to get painted and clean. I'm going to replace the side cover. I'm replacing the gas tank. Um... On this side as well, frame, so, uh, swing arm, both cowls, the rear signal lights are going to be, they are already, I don't even know if you saw that, but they're already LED, but I'm switching, I don't know yet, I'm probably switching out from the uh, the standard tail lights like that and just get LED strips to go on it, but all of this is going to be going away, um, I won't have any of this, the only thing I'll have is the Speedo. Um, there's an integrated headlight that I have, um, but anyway, that that's what that's what also came. the uh, The old one is actually in the is in here, along with the wire harness, which I have to throw all this way um, for recycling. Um, the old wire harness, the intake manifold from the landlord's SUV over there, and the TV, and then there's the red seat that was on the bike the one that someone put regular someone took regular leather to put on the seat of the bike and it just faded away so we have our note 9 and we have our bull bar that goes for the ram um made in china as always um but essentially the reason that i was asked to show this is because um on this ram, there's two ways to mount a bull bar. You can mount it from underneath, uh, where it wraps underneath, or you take your inserts out. That's plastic, and I have a steel bumper. The plastic inserts come out, and they go, you bolt directly to the frame, the undercarriage of the frame. Well, um, my truck, my truck has the aero package on it. Um, which you know you have the aero package if you have the uh, the dreaded. I don't know if you guys can see in there, but I have the uh, active grill shutters in the truck. So that's one of the reasons why I haven't installed a light bar inside of the truck. But it's got active grill shutters on it, and underneath, let's see if I can get down to show you. Underneath, I have the this diffuser or chin, and underneath it, there's a uh, plastic cover as well for aerodynamics uh, I mean it works pretty well I mean I I average about in the city I average 22 to 25 miles to the gallon and on the highway I average about 30 to 33 miles to gallon in this which may drop a little bit when I add that on it and it may drop a little more because I'm planning on leveling it out because the chin rubs on crap but I'm trying to decide which one to do. Um, I've got a request from another video, I mean another uh, site to do a my Note 9 unboxing. And I had requests from YouTube to do the uh, bull bar unboxing. Um, and the person that wanted to see the Note 9 unboxing also wants to see the bull bar unboxing. But I will, in fact do both unboxings um, I have to go in the truck and I have to find my tripod my mini tripod I have to find that because I don't know where it is um, it was in the seat uh, as many times as I've been cut off yep there it is as many times as I've been cut off it fell off which it also has my um, it's got my other mount on it which I have to take off it's the mount for my monster camera, I think. What is that? But right now I'm recording on the Note 8 
So the Note 8 doesn't have a, um, try to take the uh, thing off. This is the end of it. The Note 8 doesn't have a, um, a mount for it. At least I don't have a mount for it. So I'm going to switch over to the um, Easy Share, which I don't really want to use that one, but it's the only one I have that I can use that on because if I use the monster, um, the video will be great, but the audio won't. So I'll switch over to that one. And uh, if the video is not good on it, I want to use the phone really badly. But I may try to use my monster and just try to mount it and see how the audio, how bad the audio really is on it. But uh, we're going to go with that. We're going to unbox the Note 9. And then after that, we're going to unbox the um, bull bar. And then now the unboxing for the bull bar and the installation of the bull bar will not be in the same video because it, this is going to be a first for me as well for installing the bumper through the grill. Well, not, not necessarily. I did it on my uh, third gen, but um, there's more plastics to remove on this truck than it is on the other one. So it's going to be a learning curve for that. I mean, it's going to be pretty straightforward, but it's going to be a learning curve because it's getting hotter. Uh, so, well, here it goes. We're going to go with that. Um, I'm also trying to decide whether or not I wanted to, If I actually end up shooting it with both either one of the cameras... I'll end up, what I'll do is I will, um, it's going to be a regular upload where I have my intro and outro, but if I don't and I end up recording, it'll be with this, and it'll just be a regular upload or regular vlog upload. So, um, stay tuned. Um, uh, we're about to, the Note 9 isn't really an unboxing as many people that have it on online, but... Even though there's not much of a difference, uh, I'll be unboxing one of the 512 gigabyte models that um, some people wanted to know if you unbox it with a particular carrier, do you get certain things in it? Because in some unboxings you got a case with it, some unboxing you didn't. I bought a uh, OtterBox case for a temporary case because I wanted the Samsung stand one. But I will be getting that one, but I will be showing you all of that in that video. Because it's going to be three videos. Uh, I'm going to try to shoot today, but they probably won't be all uploaded today. I'm going to try to shoot the unboxing of the Note 9, the unboxing of the bull, the bull bar, and the unboxing, not the unboxing, but the install of the bull bar. Now, what I may end up doing is I may end up actually, you know... In the video for the phone, in the unboxing, I may end up doing the setup as well as the um, installation of the Autobox case that I bought, which is pretty straightforward. But, you know, for people that want to see, um, I have a screen protector, but I don't know if it is going to work out well because it's, they don't have any Note 9 screen protectors out there yet. So I'm going to have to go up there today and find out if they have one or not, if they any came in. So we're going to see where that goes with it and see if I have a Note 8 screen protector that can go on it, but I want to know. So, let's go. Let's get it there. I'm really tired. I'm sorry. Mm.